Hey everyone, welcome to TechScale and in this video we are going to unbox the new Realme 11 Pro that is a 5G phone that was launched a couple of days back. So if you can see this is a Realme 11 Pro 5G and this comes with a 108 megapixel camera and a curved vision display and if you notice this comes with a 67 watt charger and on top of that this comes with a 100 megapixel OIS camera and the latest 7050 5G chipset by uh, this is Diamond City by MediaTek right so let's let's unbox this and see what all the contents are there in the phone so first of all real me thing that says dear to leap so this is probably some paperwork Let's keep the phone here and see what are we having in the paperwork section. So, okay, nice. So they are giving a TPU case. That was not expected, but thankfully they have given a TPU case. So that's very nice. So another some other paper material is here. Let's keep it aside. And let's now unbox the phone. Great. So, okay, we have a couple of things around here as well. Okay, so we got a very OnePlus-ish charger. Oh, the, the charger for strange reasons is 80 watts, but the phone says that it simply supports 67 watts. 67 watts is still a lot of uh, charging power. And here comes the okay. Sadly, it's not a USB C to C. It's still USB A to USB C. It's 2023 now. Company should start switching from C to C for high power delivery and other stuff, right? So let's keep it aside and. Okay, let's keep the case here. So here is the phone. Let's unbox it. And if you see, here comes the Realme branding here, right? And a couple of other things are here. So let's, if you can see, we have USB Type C here. The uh, SIM tray is here. Let's also put the check what are we having in the SIM tray section. I'm not able to find the. Okay, here is the pen. Right, so let's put it here and yep, it is coming out. And oh, we are also having this if you can see this rubber thing going around. So, this can be somewhat, I'm not sure, they don't have an official IP rating. So, this is a dual in smartphone, no SD slot. So, let's put it back. Let's keep this aside for a second. Let's power the phone. So this says real me. So I'll simply fast forward the video from here and let's see what are we having here on the home screen. So the phone has successfully booted up and you can see we already have a couple of bloatware apps that were installed as soon as I uh, uh, just loaded the, uh, I mean booted the phone, right? So we have a realme community, clone phone, I don't know, some of these apps are really just like, this is a nonsense game, I don't know why it is here, but a lot of bloatware was here and I'm very sure that a lot more bloatware will come because there is almost 730 items that are still being installed for strange reason this is happening and they have also provided an app market which is definitely their version of play store which and you for strange reasons you cannot disable it so that's very very sad so let's open the camera of this phone okay we agree and okay this looks decent so this is my oneplus 8 pro if you can see yeah, this, oh, if I, I took a couple of pictures and this phone simply, and now this time this didn't happen, but you saw last time it happened, right? So if we go to the video mode, let's see what all modes do we have. So we have a 1080p mode, a 4K mode, right? So if I go to 4K, I think we have 60fps 4K as well. That is smooth, that is nice, but okay that's it for the camera side and if we go to the more settings of the camera let's see what else do we have and apart from that we have a watermark thing going on around here and 
couple of other modes high efficiency images also that support support in the iphone and apart from that this is how the phone looks like overall look and the feel of the phone is this is 120 hertz uh, out of the box if i go to display we have these things going on around here so we have a bright hdr video mode as well so video color boost is also here so okay we, nice i will also be doing a couple of benchmarks to know how this phone performs and maybe we can do some other tests as well if you have any certain requirement that you would want me to do i would be happy to do that for you guys for you folks absolutely <laughs> right so that's all for this video and i will see you in the next one if you found this video helpful please like and subscribe to the channel i will see you in the next one bye